When was the last time you saw a Paper Mario episode that opened up with me having Paracarry as my partner out? I don't know, but hey guys, it's Colorful Artie for more Paper Mario. Alright, so... Move it, jerk quads. <laughs> Paracarry's like, yay! I did something! Well, that's enough doing stuff, Paracarry. Let's get back to Goombario. I'm kind of amazed that we haven't seen a Crazy Daisy run away from battle yet. So you're wondering, why are you going back to Petunia? Well, we're going this way. <laughs> so, we can throw something in the well, you want to throw a blueberry in. <gasps> Who's throwing stuff down into my well? Huh? This is a blueberry. I love these. Thank you. I'll give you this in return. I will get the Flower Saver Badge! You save one FP for every attack you use. Isn't it ironic we're getting all of the flower-themed badges in the flower fields? Forget that. <laughs> hey, dude. Aw, oh, I'm so hungry. I'm tired of guarding this stupid old gate. I'm so, so hungry. Hey, you there! I don't suppose you'd have anything good to eat that you'd like to give me? Listen, if you give me something succulent, I'll let you through here and I won't tell anybody. Have a blueberry. Mmm, a blueberry? I'm sure this will be gross. Mm -hmm. Oh, how delicious! Such a splendid taste! There are good blue things! I'm filled with hope again. Go, go and never feel blue. I'll never forget you. Well, fun! Well, fun! Forgot about these guys. This is a Spiny. Spinies have spikes on their shells that are pretty sharp. Max HP 5, attack power 4, defense power 3, yes! They'll roll into Spiny eggs and slam into you. It'll be much easier to fight them if you can flip them over. Their defense power falls to zero. I'll just use a single power quake. Because I've got all or nothing on. I can kill them both ju I can kill all Spinies just with a single power quake. That'll be nice. Ooh, also interesting thing here. You see that brick block? Yep. And we get a shooting star. Oh, yeah. Take this. Wah! I love Power Quake! I wish I had- Actually, you know what? It's kinda good I don't have Mega Quake, cause Power Quake is enough. Also, get out Goombario. You guys remember Lakitu's? Hey, where'd you drop it, idiot? Huff and Puff will have our clouds if we don't find it! Oh man, I'm so clumsy! That stone gave out an endless supply of water! Without it, we can't increase the power of the Puff Puff machine! It's just gotta be around here somewhere. It's just gotta be! What? Is that Mario? Look, man, it's Mario! Let's look for the stone later. Let's rough this dude up. Oh no, Mario? Are you sure? I'm not sure that I'm, you know, in the right mental state. Nah, forget it. I'll fight anyways. Here it comes, Mario. This is a Lakitu. Lakitus are strange Koopas that can ride clouds. Max HP 12, attack power 3, defense power 0. They toss down spiny eggs, and these sometimes turn into crawling spinies. We'd better deal with them quickly or we'll be surrounded by spinies. It seems like these Lakitus have been hassling you for the, your entire career, Mario. Yeah, they have. So let's take out the Lakitus first. <laughs> I love how their clouds get the tons out. Hey. Hey. Nope. Hey. Yeah. Okay. Cool. <laughs> Not sure which is funnier, the Lakitu's expression or the Cloud's expression when they take damage. Never spiny? Yes, please. Oh, 
Finish him! It, nah. It's a far cry from how we were at the beginning of the game, huh? And 12 star points is not bad either. I'm beginning to think that my spell wore off and I didn't notice. And now for the hedge maze. There we go. Oh boy. I'll get Mega Quake. Yes, I can afford Mega Quake now. Oh, hello. It seems like ages since I last saw a visitor here. I'm Rosie, a rose spirit. I'm ever so glad to meet you. Here I am in full bloom, and there's probably nobody to look at me. Please admire me all you like. Breathtaking, aren't I? Aren't I just incredible? Yeah, sure. Really? I'm that beautiful? You're so honest and charming, and underneath that scruffy mustache, I bet you're handsome. I like you, and because I like you, I'll show you this. This stone, isn't it beautiful? I found it just the other day. Some strange creatures on the clouds dropped it. I couldn't resist its gorgeous glitter, so I made it mine. I could look at it all day. Huh? What did you say? I should give you the stone? Oh dear, you're saying Lily's in trouble without this? How very sad. Oh well, it can't be helped. The stone is mine now, you see. You mean Lily will wither up without this stone? Huh, how sad. Really, how very pitiful. As hard as it is to believe that Lily sometimes acts like she's prettier than I am. She's dumb, but she's not evil, and if she's gone, there'll be no flowers to set off my beauty. Let's see, tell you what. If you bring me something more beautiful than this stone, I'll think about trading it. What a jerk! So let's wait till then. Not a fan of Rosie. And by the way, that pun is too obvious. How about a, like a rose called Bramble or something like that? Ah, ha, ha. Move its spinies. Well, remember that crystal tree that Posey has? We're going there. Ow. Cool. Flower fields is just... It's not very fun. Hey, Posey. Oh? Rosie told you to bring her something beautiful? Rosie really loves beautiful things above all else. She's a little self-involved, have you noticed? You really need help, huh? Okay, I'll help you. This tree and I are connected by our roots, so maybe one or two crystal berries will fall down if I shake the root. Hmm. Uh, hi -ya! Whew. Oops, that was a bit unladylike. <laughs> Rosie should be more or less satisfied with that berry. And we get the crystal berry! It's a, glimmer a glimmering berry made of crystal. Looks a lot like a ring pop. Posey's nice. I like her. Even if she does have a Pinocchio nose. Okay. Now we get to back... There's just a lot of backtracking in this world. As you can probably see. Although the Flower Fields does contain an enemy that's really good for level grinding, I will be taking advantage of that. Otherwise, I will not make it to max level before we beat the game. Have you found anything? Here's a ring pop. Oh, how pretty! I love it! It's much nicer than this ugly old stone. You'd better hurry back and give this stone to Lily. Make sure she knows that she was saved because of me. No, she wasn't. She almost died because of you. 
Oh, such loveliness. I've gotten so beautiful, I'm starting to scare myself. Who's the most beautiful flower in all the flower fields? That is me, of course. Ugh. That's the kind of people that really drains me as an introvert. They're obsessed with themselves. Then again, I guess you could say that about me. I mean, I spend most days just playing video games and talking to myself. Ah! Doo -doo -doo. Okay. Never fear, Lily. Let's hope that the super rare, really tough enemy appears over here. So one of the two crazy daisies that were over here last time, occasionally one of them will be a rare enemy. And we got it! See that gold one? That's the one we want! They will run away from us. Crud. Let's see, Starstorm. It's very risky going into a battle against the Golden Daisy, though. It's a very, 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 very powerful and strong enemy. And they'll run away 90% of the time. But if it decides to attack, I will be dead. So I gotta think how I want to do this. Do I want to just go in and tattle on it? Or do I want to try to actually kill it? Oh, I've got an idea. First off, can I eat something to get more... Ugh, no, I can't really, actually. Oh my, okay. It's an amazing daisy. This is an amazing daisy. Amazing daisies are so rare that they're also called legendary crazy daisies. Max HP 20, attack power 20, defense power 1. These guys are almost always flee at their first chance. It would be nice to beat one, but be careful, their attacks pack a powerful punch. That's an understatement. You know what? Just in case they do attack, I'm gonna use Smooch. I'm almost guaranteeing that that one will run away. I'm just gonna say that. They literally run away 90% of the time. I hope they don't die because of that. Rats, they ran away. I'll get another berry. Hey, Lily! We got your water stone back. Oh, it's the water stone! Quickly, put it in that hole there. This part's pretty cool. Ooh, look at that water. And that rainbow. It's so beautiful! Oh, it's water, sweet water. The spring is full of water. I'm floating again. Oh, this is paradise. Thank you so very much. I'll give you some miracle water from the spring. Here you are. And we get the miracle water. Very cold water. It glitters in the sun. This is the most nourishing water around. It's water with a little lily extract. If you use this miracle water on any plant, it'll grow like game busters. Uh, but not right now, because there's no sun. Oh yes, great idea. You should go see about getting in the sun back in the sky. A resourceful guy like you must have some idea on how to get the sun back up again. I bet you'll do it. You saved me after all. Hey, Sushi. So now we can reach this island, hit the bubble tree. And we get a bubble berry, a berry found in the flower fields, restores 5 HP, and I can't carry anymore, are you kidding me? Guess I'll get rid of the blueberry.
We need the bubble berry. We don't need the blueberry. All right, enemies grow back. Let's keep moving off and back on until we get an amazing daisy, shall we? Perfect. Let's take out the other guy first. First stop, batch configuration. None of these charging weapons, let's see. Money, money could be useful. Ah, well, okay. We need the other power plus. <laughs> Oh, we also need quick change. Yeah, basically we need to corner it and blow it up with Bombat as the first strike. Perfect! Power smash. <laughs> Maybe we don't need quick change. Yes. <laughs> Look at all that star points. Yeah, that is why it is so good for level grinding. And of course, all those power pluses sure help. Oh, sorry, honey syrup. Not exactly a necessity. Well, time to re-equip all the stuff. <laughs> Refund, I spy, speedy spin. Power jump, jump charge, power bounce, power quake. Eh, we don't need first attack in here, I don't think. We could equip. Ah! Such a waste, though. I think we'll do that. Yeah. Yeah, you can see now why Amazing Daisies are by far the best for getting star points. In fact, I might very well max out my level very soon. That would make the rest of the game very boring. Or very awesome. <laughs> Alright. So now this way, there are the spikes there. Hi, my name's Bubble Plant. You wanna know why my name's Bubble Plant? I'll tell you if you give me a bubble berry. Oh, awesome! Good going! Okay, get a load of this! Um... Uh, I like to think that Bubble Plant has a really deep voice. There! Isn't it great? Jump inside. I like how the logs do that. Now we can get a star piece, don't fall off, or we'll have to go back and get another bubble berry. Hey, dude. Ooh! I actually will not kill the other bazap, because then this guy might... Then this guy might run away. This is a green Magic Koopa. He's one of the magicians in the Koopa Clan. Max I have to admit, I like those green robes. Very cool. Max HP 11, attack power 3, defense power 0. He can ma magically increase the defense power of others. He looks pretty surly. Okay, the bees have- the bizaps have never shown off their other attack. They've got another attack.
Or they summon up like six little bizaps that all attack you and deal one damage. Alright, he'll run away. Oh man, the zaps do not give a lot of star points. I'll just you hit amazing daisies. Eh, I'm gonna ignore you. Oh yes, this badge. We get the Mega Smash Badge! It hammers an, an enemy with a huge amount of attack power. So it's like Power Smash, but it deals an extra two damage. It also needs, you know, more FP to take, uh, equip. Free! It needs free FP! Oh. Feel some on equipping first attack. Also, the music in here is amazing. Seriously underrated music here. It's the Sun Tower. Hey, hello. I never thought anyone would come all the way up here. I'm the Sun. No, that's not entirely true. I should say I was the Sun. The clouds that came out of the Puff Puff machine that Huff and Puff built. Those clouds keep me from climbing into the sky. I'm a complete failure as a sun. All the flowers and plants and flower fields are suffering. Where is it? You mean the Puff Puff machine? I think it's east of here. The clouds seem to come from over there anyway. Why do you want to know? Do you think you can break the Puff Puff machine? Nah, there's no way. Don't strain yourself. You might as well go home. It's the sun. Some people call it the Blessed Sun. It's the source of life for flowers and trees. If it doesn't come out, eventually all plants wither away. Sunshine makes me happy, too. The sun's very depressed, though. Oh boy. Oh boy. Time for a very, uh, interesting fight now. Hey, 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 hey! Hold up! Wait, man! Hey man, I don't think we've ever met, have we? I mean, you're Mario, right? My name is Wackalester. Uh, no, it's Michael. No, um... Oh yeah, Spike. Yeah, yeah, I'm Spike. Well, whatever, never mind. Look, I don't have a problem with you personally, but I've got orders from Huff and Puff. Sorry, man, but I have to give you a bit of a beatdown. Like I said, man, sorry. Did I sound cool? Ha, yeah, totally cool. Here it comes, man! Interesting little mini boss here. Tattle on Spike? He said his name is Spike. He seems to be a Lakitu, but he's the weirdest one I've seen. Max HP 50, attack power 4, defense power 0. He throws spiny eggs. Is it just me or did he call himself Spike, Michael, and Lacka Lester? What an odd guy. I have to wonder just what his real name is. Hey, nope. Well, whatever this guy's name is, he's not that hard. Especially if you've got Ultra Rank Goombario. That is hard to defend against. The timing is completely off. How the... <laughs> oh, I love that. <laughs> I have no idea the timing on how to defend that. Let's fan smack him again. Killed by a fan. <laughs> That's really good against enemies with zero defense. Ugh, man.
Man, you're tough as nails. I give up, man. Go on, do your worst. I'm not afraid of it. Do whatever you do to guys you've defeated. Fire flower in the eye. Pow block. Wait! Ah, oh, no! Wackalulu! No, please! Please have mercy on my poor sweet Wackalester! Ah, oh, don't call me Wackalester! It's Spike, remember? I told you I changed my name last month. Come on now! Man, I mean, gee whiz, you're always embarrassing me like this. Although, for some reason, it makes me like you even more. I mean, what? No! Did I just say that out loud? Forget that I said that! Anyway, I lost the challenge man to man, so we have to settle this. I have to face the music. Mario, please forgive him. My lack of was just following Hufflepuff's orders. Don't forgive. He's really sweet! Please don't take my sweetie away from me! <laughs> Mario, please forgive him. <laughs> Fine. Really? Oh, for real? You'll forgive him? Oh, thank you. Stop calling me Lackalester! It's such a stupid name! My name is Spike! Spike! Don't you ever listen to me? <sighs> I'm beginning to think that this whole deal is stupid. I was working for Huff and Puff to be part of something big, but all I've been doing is picking pointless fights. This isn't what I wanted in life. What I wanted was... Hey man, I got a question. What in the world are you doing all this fighting for? Um, for world peace. World peace, huh? Isn't that a bit melodramatic? Still, I have to admit, there's a certain manly charm to having such a noble purpose. Yeah, that's the way to go. I'm going with you, man. Oh no, Lackalester, you can't leave me! Please take me with you. Oh, Lackalulu, chill out. You gotta understand, I'm doing this for you, don't you see? I'm going. I gotta be a man. Wait for me, I'll return in a much more manly Lackatoo. Oh, okay, I'll wait for you, Lackalester. But you'll be sorry if you don't come back to me in one piece. I swear if you make me worry, I'll take a spiny and... Okay, enough of that. <laughs> Guess I better make sure I'm tougher than you by the time I come back, huh? See me off with a smile now. You're so much cuter than when you show me those pearly whites. Bye for now. Lackalester joined your party, and he's the last party member. Press down C to ride Lackalester over spikes and lava. While in battle, he can attack by throwing a spiny egg with his spiny flip ability. Or attack all enemies by throwing many spiny eggs at once with spiny surge. So, don't get me wrong, he's not paracarry. Uh, like, paracarry takes you over gaps, whereas he can just take you over large pits of obstacles. But he's he doesn't like it. Oh my Lackalester, come back to me. I'll be waiting with a smile. Ah, come on! Call me Spike! So, like, Paracarry, if he flew off here, would, like, actually fly a little higher than this step, or is he just sinks? So he can't fly over, like, holes, but he can fly over, like, obstacles like, say, this, where it's, like, the same level. All right. Oh, this also makes uh, see, checking if there are Amazing Daisies much easier. There is. Yes. Hey, Doofus. Alright, so yeah, we got Spiny Flip, or then Spiny Surge. So we'll do Spiny Flip. Just move the cursor in with the bigger cursor. It's that simple. Oh boy. Ouch. I'm surprised that hasn't put me to sleep yet, to be perfectly honest. Lackluster's an interesting last party member, I'll say that. Alright.
Time to kill another one. Yes! Excellent. Oh, <laughs> Yay! Hmm, thank you for that. I am taking a berry back! I've got some recipes to make. Actually, you know what? I'm not sure if the mystery does count as the recipe, though. Oh, come on! Goodbye, honey syrup. There is no way that guy... Oh, no, he doesn't. You do have to leave the flower fields or save and quit in order for the Amazy Daisy to respawn. I'll come back for that upgrade block, but honestly, we're running out of time, and I just want to make a quick recipe and go to sleep. Hehehe. <laughs> Mega Quake. Seven FP. Well, I mean, for this area, my power quake's gonna be sufficient. I've been taking a lot of damage. All right. Blueberry. Cake mix. We get the big cookie. Excellent. All right. It wasn't dried fruit and a berry. It was strange leaf and a berry. All right, strange leaf, blueberry. Yay, and now we get a sleepy sheep, and that's the last super, super weird recipe we get, I believe. We almost have them all. I can think of at least two we can't get till the next world, and then a lot of them it's like, well, we need Ultra Shrooms, and then we need Jam and Jellies. Only four more items, dang it! Alright, out of all these, I am going to take out a Super Shroom. Super Shroom! And a Jam and Jelly. And we get the Jelly Super! A dessert made by Taste Tea restores 10 FP and 10 HP and 50 FP. Yeah. It's pretty good. It's pretty good. Gonna go down the warp pipe. Alright, 64 coins, we'll buy it. Yay! We get the Bump Attack Badge! Let's Mario destroy a weaker enemy in the field just by running into it. And that's the last rare item you get from Rip Cheeto, I believe. Maybe you get another star piece? Don't think so, though. That might be worth a fortune worth checking. We didn't take a nap. Oh, sweet. <laughs> One star point. Nice to know Dark Koopas still do give out star points. I don't want a power walk. 
Yeah, now that we've got Wacko Lester, we can go across here. Ow. Maple syrup. Sweet. Get it? Stop watch. Okay, forget the pow block. I said forget the pow block. <sighs> Darn it. I realize I don't think I even need to equip the power plus badges for the Amazing Daisies. <laughs> no, thank you. Through here. You got the Ultra Boots! The attack power of Mario's jump increases! On top of that, you can now do a tornado jump by pressing A again while in the air. That'll make you jump higher, so... You can do that now. And of course, Ultra Jump is just cool. Well, I'm not complaining about that. But I mean... Really needs an FP. And refresh is not gonna cut it. Life Shroom. Oh boy. Gotta use Star Storm. I don't want power blocks! Does it look like I want power blocks? Because I don't. Alright, I also don't need Sleepy Sheep. After Kent C. Koopa, they literally have no point. Oh ho. A uh, Voltrum? Yeah, no, I don't think so. Actually. Well, hang on a second. I might as well drink the maple surf up if I'm just gonna throw it away. At least a Volt Shroom could be made into a Life Shroom or a Hot Shroom. Later, loser! Alright, it is definitely time to end the episode off here. Oh, come on! You're not, you're seriously not gonna let me drop down there. Well, nearest safe point is at Yoshi's Island, so thanks for watching. I'm Colorful Artie. If you tune in for the next episode, we will probably finish up the flower fields and maybe grind on some Amazing Daisies more. Have a great day, and God bless.